it's graduation day and you're not here. And I want you to know that not a day has gone by that I haven't thought about you, about what happened that night. You've changed my life for the better just by being a part of it. We've laughed till we couldn't stop. You made me believe that there was good in the world and you've gotten me through hard and sad times when no one else could. There's no one like you. Not a single soul in the eight billion people on this earth. You are beautiful and wonderful and talented and so beyond amazing. You know, it's the little things that seem so small that I cherish the most. I cherish every memory I have of you, but I've been looking back at all our pictures and all I see is happiness. I wish I could see you one more time, that you'd come walking through my door and I could hear your voice again, but I know it's not gonna happen and my heart is aching knowing that I lost you. It's been two years without you and I don't know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> We were gonna graduate college together and live in New York City in a tiny little shoebox apartment. We were gonna do what we loved together and we were gonna be broke and struggle together, but no matter what, we would be there for each other. And, and now I don't know what I'm gonna do. I can't do it without you. It's not fair that I get to graduate, that I get to move on. You deserved every bit of life that I got, if not more. I haven't really talked to your parents since the accident. Uh, I haven't really known what to say. I didn't know how to even begin. I felt kind of out of place at your funeral, like I, like I shouldn't be there. And I know saying I'm sorry isn't going to bring you back. Nothing will. And it's my fault. Going to that party was stupid and we should have called someone to pick us up. But I said, trust me, I can drive us home. And you did. We were both just so drunk and I didn't want our parents to know, but now the only thing I see in your parents' eyes is loss. And it's my fault. I know it's my fault that you're not standing here with me. I'm sorry. <laughs>